Yo, what's up guys, CO2 on tape here, back on FS22, and yeah, today, we got a long drive. Uh, I already got the trucks loaded up, I just strapped them all down. I am bringing the single cab K30, lift it up, with the, the boggers on it, with the beautiful Chevy in the middle. In the middle. And then we're bringing that Toyota Hilux. But well, first off, you could already see it, because I got shut this door, because I had the, yeah, it was a lot of running around. I was wanting to bring that truck, but I don't know what is going on, but I can't get it to attach, so it is it is what it is. But uh, I'm going to shut this door. I want to show you guys the two square bodies. I kind of made this square body look pretty similar to the one I had, which it has a back rack, uh, it's a diesel, it has a little pipe right there. 24 valve, 6 speed manual, like. Can I? There we go. Like, I don't know why I had to have it running, but look how clean that looks. That looks. Ooh. Has a Dodge motor in it. That don't make. Okay. Is what it is, though. Has Dodge motor. That's fine. But it does have a light, so we can at least see this Dodge motor in the, <laughs> in the Chevy. But the K30 is what I like the most. Like, look at that. We got the LED after, er, yeah, LED headlights sitting on 37s, beadlock rims, very clean interior. Like, hold on, let's open up this door. Like, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. I kind of left the interior the same. I left it the 454 big block. I cleaned it up a little bit. I didn't turn this to a diesel or anything, just 454 big block. Like, man. Got the tailgate. But got the flags on the back, flagpole holder, which looks sick. Got the Chevy. Like, it, it came out to be a very clean truck. Let's pop this open. On the other side, but yeah, it's man, look at that, that's awesome. Can you even pop the gas pop or gas cap open? That's awesome. Like, look at this. I can't, I can't do it on this truck. I'm just sad, but yeah, I just figured let you know that I did finish working on them the last couple of months and they came out clean, had some help. They look beautiful. Still got the suburban over there. What about throwing mud tires on this? I don't really use the Suburban a whole lot. Like, it's just, it's there. To be there, but, uh, yeah. I haven't, I haven't, what the hell? Damn door. But yeah, we are going to that off-road park. So I got a long ways to go. I was showing you guys that, uh, those trucks. But, uh, like I said, it was going to be a long ways to go. I finally cleared up on weather. It's still a little bit chilly. Next month, I'm going to be starting to plant corn and stuff. So, that's exciting. But, uh, yeah. We got a long ways to go and a long drive. So, I'll see you guys soon as we get to the off-road park. Alright. Better. It was a long drive. We got the got the Dodge over there. There's a dog running around this place. This place is, you know, pretty sick for the most part. But, this is a rock crawling trail this is the start of it there's a bunch of rocks here but the trail starts up there and yeah let's get right into this we're gonna we're gonna start with the, the Toyota first the Toyota Hilux so let's get the spin around and we'll officially start on the trail okay let's get into this thing we'll leave the, the square body there hopefully we don't mess this up because I do plan on bringing this truck home yeah, there's a bunch of rocks right there to crawl on, stuff like that. I'm assuming you go everywhere, but we're just going to start on the main trail first. And, uh, this is obstacle one. Stage one. Let's see how good this, uh, this Toyota does, because I just bought this. We gotta go through these cones. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know how good... This is gonna do because I think with the two bar, the two bar right there, that front bar is not gonna help us in any means. But actually, hey, we're doing doing a lot better. If we could get past stage one, I'm fine with it. 
get up here. Yeah, we're gonna keep hitting on that bar. There we go, keep spinning the wheels. Oh yeah, look at that feather. Nope. Now we got some logs up here. Oh man, I really hope we don't have to pass that canal. <laughs> I don't I don't have high faith in this truck. Alright. Look at the flex in this thing. Flex is definitely pretty crazy. Alright, this is a sketchy part right here. We gotta get these wheels lined up. <laughs> this is sketchy. This is there's already a branch. Oh, I need to straighten those wheels out. Straighten that front wheel out. Just full sender up there. There we go. <laughs> that was that was scary. That was that was kind of sketchy. Come on, there we go. Finally grab that. For this being stage one, this is this is crazy. Stuck. But honestly, if we get stuck in here, I don't know how they're gonna. There we go, we got that perfect. Alright. Now, this is. This is challenging right here. I don't. I'm gonna try hugging it to the right. Because. And then cross over right here. There we go. I don't want to fall in that crack because I have a ooh, I have a good feeling we are not gonna make it out. What the hell is this stuff? I should not have brought the Toyota. This is the first time coming to this crawling place. But the Toyota is doing amazing. Like it has not spun, it has like the best grip <laughs> string that oh, it almost tipped it over. We tipped it over, it's screwed. Trying to avoid tipping it over. Crazy thing about that, this is stage one, but we already went through all this. And now we're even on more challenging shit. Oh, there's a bridge right here. Uh oh. There's kind of like gaps in between this bridge. I don't. Okay, good. Oh no, we're hung up. Ooh. Wait, if I can somehow get that, can't get that back tire out of here. All right, I was able to get out of that. That glory hole. I don't know why it's there because. That. Oh my god. This is like just wide enough. I need to keep it on these two front. Like that flex right there. Ooh, I this is sketchy. And we already fell. Oh there we go, we saved it. Alright, there we go, that's perfect. We gotta stay in the cones. I can't believe this is still stage one. There might have to be a part two for the K30. Cause so I'll have to go through all this with the K30. I, I probably should not have brought two vehicles, but I want to try making it so two vehicles, or at least go through this with the two vehicles I brought. This Hilux cannot turn whatsoever. <laughs> At least I know the the Carolina squat was not a or the Carolina not the blue, but the Carolina crawler sticker on the front is worthy of it because I'd say it did a pretty damn good job. All right, that don't make no sense because if I got a
Okay, tell me how this makes sense. I'm assuming... I don't know. I don't know where I crossed for that in these. I guess I could technically skip through this obstacle. Oh, I'm trying to full send it. We'll send it through. Ooh, I almost hit that cone. Oh, we don't really almost hit that cone. I'm, ass I, I'm assuming I didn't have to go through there. Yeah, I messed that up because I should have went right straight through. But at least I know what the K30 now. They're really close. I gotta get these two front tires lined up on this pole because if we fall, I might have to say goodbye to the Toyota because I'm assuming would have to scrap it after this. Oof, there we go. We made it. I'm, I'm amazed about this crap, because I figure since we're almost here, we're almost to the end, we might as well just do part two, because the finish line's right there. And then part two will be the K30 through all this. Got a whole bunch of tree stumps. We're full sending it. We're gonna launch it. Hopefully, oh, right when I was getting ready to set it, I was like, hopefully we don't we don't flip this. But uh, all right, on to stage two. Stage one was crazy, so I don't know how hard stage two is gonna be. But they call that stage one, then. Stage two is the canyon run. Oh my god. And then there's a whole bunch of cars through here. Doing some monster truck shit now. This is not sketchy at all. Get through right up in here. Try to hit these lines as best as possible. Okay. Oh, we're already hung up. Might definitely in the future get rid of this front pull bar and find a stock bumper or something like that. Because that's getting hung up pretty quick or on a lot of things. I didn't really think that was going to get hung up, but hey, here we are. I haven't done no first person. Really? You're going to... This is not sketchy at all. <laughs> we're, we're right on this. And that is probably pretty deep. We fall in, this truck is staying here, I guess, because I'm not going to try fishing it out, and I don't think there's, unless with a helicopter and train or something, no way to, definitely no way to pull this out, I have to go swim, it'd be, it'd be done for. I do have to give this rock crawling place a 10 out of 10. I feel bad for the guy that had to come in here and bring all this crap in just to make it a challenge. And we're already stuck. Come on. We're always tired. There we go. I hope the K30 does better. Or yeah. I think, yeah, K30 is single tab. Okay found some life where there's grass and stuff so I'm assuming we come up through here the arrow points there so I'm guessing gotta come up over these rocks there's a bunch of bunch of trees down right here 
Oh my god. Like I said, we get hung up. We, uh, like that tree. We back up. I'm trying to not get bottomed out to the point where. There we go. <laughs> Alright, I need to figure out where we're going. There's a bunch of water down there. Now we're going down the steep terrain. This is crazy for stage two. And I thought stage one was a little crazy because Yeah, you know, I'm assuming we could yeah, they don't the water don't look that deep, so we could drive through the water. Right there kind of looks deep. Slippery rocks. Hump over, or yeah, hop over here. Oof. Uh oh. No, that's what I did not want to do. There we go. We'll send her out. Luckily, this trip. Oh my. <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna get up over these cans. Oh, that was a lot easier than I suspected. Oh, never mind. I spoke too soon. Okay, there's a good line right there. There we go. Able to get up, just full sender through. This might be one of the best rock crawling maps I ever, I ever been in. I knew about this for a long time. I, I seen brochures and stuff like that, but I never actually took anything to here. Like I seen about it, was wanting to go, and then I never went. And then I was like, yeah. But I got those trucks. Or I got this truck, and ooh, my god. It could have ended badly. There we go. The good old Toyota Hilux. I don't know how long this stage two is, but oh, it's right down there. If we had made it, that would have been awesome. The minimum damages. Not a whole lot of damages anyway. There's some cones there. Oh, I don't want to tip this. Oh, we hit that cone. <laughs> we'll, we'll go in the water. There we go. I think we're at the end. Oh, shit. And now we got... We made it through all that rock the valley and stuff and to hit tires and a whole bunch of tree stones gotta give this Toyota Hilux some credit we soared through it pretty quick Ooh. and a whole bunch of damaged cars and stuff like that I'm assuming it's the end I think it's the end if you guys did enjoy this video, we're gonna turn that down or turn that off and Yeah, if you did enjoy this video hit that like button and subscribe part two for the k30 Would be right after this one. So Stay tuned for that and yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. Goodbye